tablet review. Hey everyone, it's Tej. Welcome back to another video. So for today, we're gonna be doing yet again another tablet review. We've reviewed Galmon, we've reviewed XP Pen, and now we're going to be reviewing Artisol. Artisol has sent me one of their tablets, which is the M0610 Pro. Does it say it right? M0610 Pro. Yeah, I said it right. Artisol has not sent me only one though. Oh gosh. <laughs> They sent me two of them because I'm gonna be giving one away. Yeet! I may drop the tablet actually. <laughs> I'm gonna be giving away to my Instagram followers only though, so make sure to follow me on Instagram, also Artisol on Instagram as well. I'm gonna be making a separate post about this since this is gonna be a little contest, so stay tuned for that, my Instagram followers. So yeah, let's see if this tablet is good. I don't know. Let's find out. Let the unboxing begin! Alright, so unboxing. Here you can see the box. Looks really fancy, right? Let's see if the insides match. And it does! Awesome! <laughs> the first thing you can see is the warranty card for the warranty policy. Then that pamphlet where it tells you to download the driver. Then you can see the tablet itself. We'll check that out in a little while. Right below the tablet, you can see a bunch of things. We have the pen case. I actually prefer pen cases over pen holders because I tend to misplace the pen holders, so whoops. Then we have the pen. It has 8192 levels of pen pressure and it's battery free. We have the smudge guard or the artist glove. I just call it artist glove because I'm an artist myself. And would you look at that? It fits my hand perfectly! <laughs> then we have the cleaning cloth to clean the tablet, obviously. And there's the quick start guide. Then there's the cable so that we can connect the tablet to the computer or our Android devices. Some extra nibs for the pen in case it wears off along with the nib remover. And two adapters. One is a micro USB and one is a USB-C. Then unpackaging the tablet. Looks really nice. It has eight keys and a dial. And below the tablet, it has four rubber feet so that whenever you're working, it'll just stay in place. And that's all that's in the box. Okay guys, so I'm about to test it on this phone right here. I tried it in my main phone, I tried this one, but it didn't seem to work. Um, it kind of saw it as a charger instead. I followed the instructions as well, but still nothing happened. So I'm just testing this with my backup phone, my old phone. Um, hopefully this works this time. Okay, yeah, it does work. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, there you go. It does work. It works perfectly fine. There's pressure sensitivity, which is good. And um, the buttons on the pen work fine as well. So yay to that. I'm not sure why it's not working with my other phone though. So maybe it's just that, but yeah. Yeah, either way, it still works on the phone. It's just my issue. <laughs> but yeah, it works perfectly fine. For anything else, of course we need to download the driver. So I went to artisol.com slash downloads and download the driver. And begin to set things up. Now, about the shortcut keys of the tablet, you can only customize 7 of them because one is actually a switch for the light. It really has a nice ring to the tablet actually, but it's kind of a waste of a shortcut key. Though I don't really mind since I don't really use shortcut keys that much. Testing it out in paint tool side and the pressure sensitivity is working well. 
let's get into drawing. For the speed paint, I decided to draw Mil Yi. She is one of the gacha tubers that inspired me to use Live 2D, and she is an amazing gacha tuber and artist. I'm gonna leave her channel link in the description box below if you want to check her out, although I'm sure you already know who she is. <laughs> well, before I say my thoughts about this tablet, enjoy the speed paint first. And every time I'm so damn lost What I loved and what I lost Well, let's get lost in love tonight Hear a second voice inside my head It's telling me to stay the night again And hold on to the words we always said It would be forever, forever Wait another day to clear my thoughts So jump into a love that won't be forgotten my thoughts about this tablet it's pretty good pressure sensitivity feels like it has 8192 levels of pen pressure the shortcut keys are really clicky and handy one shortcut key isn't customizable though because it's for the lights but again not big of a deal for me the pen is pretty responsive the work area is just right not too small not too big it feels really nice to draw on and it's affordable i really recommend this tablet for beginners intermediate artists or even hobbyists if you're interested in getting this, I will leave all the details in the description box below.
all for the M0610 Pro review from Artisol. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like, comment the word yeet if you've reached the end of this video. And don't forget to subscribe and turn that bell on, ring a ding ding for more videos. For more reviews, probably. <laughs> anyway, Siege out. Love you guys. See ya!